In this lecture we'll briefly discuss the drug, allopurinol, how it works, what it's used for, the dose and side effects, and contraindications and precautions. Allopurinol, is a uric acid reducer for gout. It inhibits xanthine oxidase, which is the enzyme that converts hypoxanthine to xanthine. Xanthine is a precursor for uric acid production, thus uric acid production is decreased. The main indication of this drug is prevention of gout arthritis and uric acid nephropathy. Note that it is not effective for treatment of an acute gout attack. It is also used as prophylaxis for chemotherapy-induced hyperuricemia. It is available as 100 and 300 mg tablets, and also available as injection. The usual dose for prophylaxis of gout attacks is 100 mg once daily, to 3 times daily, up to 800 mg per day. Note that single dose shouldn't exceed 300 mg, and dose should be weekly titrated to the recommended dosage. The usual dose for mild gout for adults is 200 to 300 mg per day, and for moderately severe gout is 400 to 600 mg per day, and 700 to 800 mg per day in severe conditions. The onset of action of this drug is from 48 to 72 hours for decline of serum uric acid level, and 1 to 3 weeks to achieve proper level. A common adverse reactions of this drug is skin rash. In this case the drug should be discontinued. Serious adverse reactions that may happen are, a granulocytosis, a plastic anemia, thrombocytopenia, hepatic injury, Stevens-Johnson syndrome, vasculitis, toxic epidermal necrolysis, neuritis, cataracts, and renal toxicity. There are also some clinically important drug interactions with this drug. Drugs that increase effects, or toxicity of allopurinol, thiazide diuretics, ACE inhibitors, and vitamin C. Allopurinol increases effects or toxicity of these drugs. Ampicillin, amoxicillin, oral anticoagulants. 6 mercaptopurine cyclophosphamide, theophylline, chlorpropamide, and alcohol. Because the incidence of acute attacks of gout, may increase during the first few months of treatment with allopurinol, colchicine, which is a uricosuric agent, or a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug, should be added to the regimen, as a prophylactic measure. This drug may cause renal failure, through acute tubular necrosis. So in case of renal function impairment dose should be reduced. Use drug in children only to treat hyperuricemia, associated with chemotherapy. This drug is category C. And it is excreted in breast milk, so caution is advised when used in nursing mothers. So, finally some advice to patients taking allopurinol. Take with meals or immediately after eating. Drink large quantities of water about 10 to 12 glasses per day. Limit foods with high purine content, such as liver or other organ meats, salmon, and sardines. Don't take large amounts of vitamin C. And don't take iron salts while taking allopurinol. Limit intake of caffeine and alcohol. Avoid driving and other activities requiring mental alertness, or that are potentially dangerous until response to drug is known. Avoid alcohol and other CNS depressants such as opiate analgesics, and sedatives such as Valium, when taking this drug. And limit exposure to UV light, as this may increase the risk of cataracts. That's all for this video. Subscribe to get more drug information.